Here's your Storm Tracker weather forecast with Chief Forecaster Bob McGuire. That's right, and we're going to wrap up your Monday with uh, one heck of a storm. Take a look at this shot. This comes to us from Sandy Dare. She's looking east from Glendive, and look at this supercell thunderstorm. This is monster saloon. It turns out this thing was over in Dickinson, North Dakota, and they, they get western to North Dakota, and they sure did on that one. Look at that cell. Wow. Now, here's a nice little picture from Janae Marie Zaharko. She just calls it checking pivots, and it also uh, snapping some photos tonight. Just a nice little shot here, and you can see a little bridge there, and it looks like possibly the Yellowstone River. But as we move on, you can see here's the way things are shaping up in Billings tonight. Really not a bad night for us currently. We're 83 degrees. We have partly cloudy skies. Northeast breeze at about 20 miles per hour. And you'll notice humidity. That's almost crunchy at about 25%. And as we move on, our high temp today topped out. Look at that. 98 degrees. 85 is the normal high, so we blew the doors off that. And we got very close to the record. That was 101. So back in 2008, the record low was 45 back in 1995. And as far as precipitation, nothing measurable fell in our rain gauge, but we did have a little shower that moved through the airport and it just produced some sprinkles. About, it got a lot of Virgo. This stuff just uh, evaporates before it gets to the ground. That's what happened tonight. When you get into those 80s and 90s, that can happen quite often. So here's where we are for the month. 9300s only need to be at 4700 to be caught up to average for a year to day totals and month to day totals. So there we're, we're still ahead of normal. Uh, and for the year, we're at 12.80. Only need to be at 9.77 to be caught up to year to date average as well. So we're doing well in that department. Current temps generally into the 60s and 70s out in the west. 60s across the high line until you get to Glasgow. We're at 72. 73 over Jordan. You see Glendive 60. Right now, Billings still one of the hot spots in the region at 83 degrees. Now, Billings actually topped out at 98 degrees, as you remember. Elsewhere, we had a lot of 90s back here in eastern Montana, Williston, North Dakota. They too wound up at 93 out in the west. Missoula and Kalispell, Great Falls all got into the 90s. Bozeman, 93. It was 94 over at the, uh, Livingston tonight. And as you'll see here, Doppler radar shows you the line of showers that moved through the Billings area. Also, some that went through Lewistown. Still got one more cell getting ready to make its way in towards Billings. So we still got a shot at some more showers tonight. But so far, a lot of the stuff is just a very light stuff. Let me show you over here. Here's Glendive. Here's Dickinson, North Dakota. And there was a big cell right back over here, right fired up right up there. That's what we saw. Wow, that was a big storm. Now you'll notice here tonight, uh, the story shows another cold front dropping down from Canada. It's expected to make its way in towards southern Montana by tomorrow morning. Then on Tuesday afternoon, here comes a new warm front moving into the region. We'll warm up a little bit on Wednesday. That warm front continues to warm up even more. We'll get back into the 90s. And then another cold front moves in from the west and it'll cool us back down into the 80s as we head into the weekend. Tonight, our temps cool back down to the 40s and 50s out west, generally 60s back here in the east, 61 of Billings, same thing over at Hardin. But tomorrow, back to the 70s, 80s, and even a few more 90s with mostly sunny skies again. But for Billings tonight, 61 degrees with partly cloudy skies, just a 20% chance for some additional showers tonight. Then for the next several days, we'll be into the 90s through Wednesday, 89 degrees on Thursday with a good chance for rain. And then after that, dry skies uh, Friday right on through Monday and temperatures rolling back down into the mid 80s. Let's go back to the desk.